is your girl Miss Drew and back again on another MX Breaks. Time to give you the entertainment. Now today, listen, Twitter is trolling, but it's not just trolling someone, it's trolling everyone. Now Twitter trends come and go, some last longer than others. The hashtag fear woman trend came as people shared their most outrageous stories where they were left blindsided by women, the power of women. Now, these are real life occurrences. Now, they are shared with an element of comedy, allowing people to laugh at each other and themselves. We all know that being blindsided and hurt is never fun. But when you reach that point to be able to turn it into a joke, then you know you've healed. So this trend is not new, and this trend is not new and has spiked every now and then. It comes off the back of several different similar hashtags. Although a lot of stories are real, they have been exaggerated for comic relief. Just remember, not everything, what did I tell you guys? Not everything you read is true. Sometimes, guys, just don't believe the lies. So just as you are trying to find a new way to do something, so are celebrities. American actor Vin Diesel came through with a surprise announcement. Mm -hmm. On the Kelly Clarkson show, he shared with her and the virtual audience that he's released a new song. Vin Diesel. I know you know Vin Diesel from Fast and Furious. Yes, and normally he's, you know, on set doing some crazy stuff. Right. This year... That is not the case, and he has found a new creative outlet. Sharing with everyone, he has debuted his new song, Feel Like I Do, with the well-known Norwegian, yeah, DJ Kygo. The song could very well be the start of something new for our beloved Vin Diesel. I just hope it doesn't take him away from our movie screens. I'm trying to, like to envisage him doing a song. Is it gonna be Latino or is it gonna be hip hop trap? Girl, boys, I'll let you guys know, I'll let you know. Now, after we collided in this much anticipated sequel to the controversial 2019 movie, After, however, it is expected with a variety of mixed reactions. Originally, a fan fiction book on One Direction star Harry Styles, yeah, the book was picked up and made into a movie. The first movie was heavily criticized at glamorizing an abusive and toxic relationship between the two main characters. So several people thought it was a harmful message to send to an impressionable youth. One Direction fans also had their two cents to share. You already know how they are. As the story was loosely based off Harry Styles, they felt the character's behavior was not only terrible, but damaging to the Styles brand. You know how those diehard fans are. However, that didn't stop anyone. The sequel is set to be released, and the third installment seems to be inevitable. We'll just have to wait and see what happens. Whenever it comes to, you know, fans and their their idols you don't play i know you've heard about beehive beehive they don't play <laughs> so what are the most important things to you a survey went around in new delhi india to people classified as the generation z from different social economic backgrounds to see if and how the pandemic shifted their priorities generation z are normally people from 1995 to 2015. Sorry, I'm not in that generation. <laughs> Their hashtag Meet Gen Z survey covered 13 to 24 year olds, asking them to prioritize eight different categories, amongst which was career, health, making money, and more. So it revealed that the top three priorities for Generation Z were actually health, fitness, and family time. And in that order. So Vivek Gupta, managing director of India, IPOS India, stated that this showed the impact it had on the generation, but also given them a new set of fears. The uncertainty towards education and work, coupled with the sudden fear of loss, has definitely shifted the perspective to appreciate the little things in life. How about you? I always ask you guys, sometimes take some time out to write a list of your top 10 priorities. 
what is most important to you. Now, this seven-year-old is definitely better at fitness than you and me. Jessie Bowen and her daughter, Bodie, are an unstoppable duo. Now, Jessie stated in the Air Force that um, she is now a figure competitor trainer and a mom of two. Her youngest, Brody, Brody, has quickly become an incredible force, having been at the gym since she was born. Imagine that. And me, it's hard for me to even get back into the gym. She was mimicking her mum's every move. Now, at the age of seven, she can squat, listen, 70 pounds, yeah? Not only is she a power lifter, Brody does gymnastics, jujitsu, yo. And for Jessie, it's always important that she makes the training sessions fun, often dancing, playing games in between. Now, they hope to encourage other mother and daughter duos to never be afraid to take on new challenges. I'm the biggest advocate for trying new things, guys. So why don't you figure out something different for you? Another young person, Charlie DeMello, the 16-year-old TikTok queen, has just got her name in the Guinness Book of World Records for 2021. She officially holds the title for most followers on TikTok. Yes. Now, she was born in 2004. Charlie was professionally dancing for 10 years before starting her social media career. She became the first person with 50 million TikTok followers on April 22nd, 2020, after being on the platform for just 10 months. She is currently on 88.5 million followers. Yo, that number doesn't even seem to be slowing down. That's like, how many people in the world? My goodness, following her on TikTok. That means if you guys have a dream, don't stop. Do not stop. It can come true whenever, when you least expect it. So, adrenaline and the love for adventure hidden in New Zealand lays on the world's most famous swing. The nearest swing creates 300 million above a valley. 3 million acres. Now, those ready to embark are given a safety guideline and securely harnessed. Brave participants can swing alone or with a partner, forward, backwards, or even upside down if feeling adventurous. Professional photographers and cameras are ready to capture every moment. There's even an option allowing a person to purely be a spectator. Bungee jumping, catapulting, and zip lines are also available. Now, <laughs> if you guys follow me on YouTube, Misery TV, you know that Drew is ready for adventure each and every time. I just don't know if I'm ready for all of that. But it sounds like an experience and definitely somebody out there should sponsor me to be able to get to New Zealand and do these amazing things. But for now, guys, that is it for our lifestyle news for today. My name is Ms. Drew. My outfit, I put a little bit of African in there today. Derry on point, D-O-P. Follow him on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram, M-Z-D-R-U. And I'm going to see you tomorrow.